Are your games lagging or stuttering on Windows 10 or 11? In this video, I'll show you step-by-step -step how to fully optimize your PC for gaming in 2025. From fixing FPS drops to unlocking full CPU power, every setting you change will boost your performance. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Step 1. Adjusting Windows Power Throttling Settings To help your computer run at full speed, especially if your PC is low-end or not very strong, you need to turn off something called Power Throttling. To turn off Power Throttling, press Windows plus R on your keyboard. A small box will appear called the Run Box. In that box, type gpedit.msc and press Enter. This will open a program called Local Group Policy Editor, where you can change some deep system settings. On the left side of this program, click through the folders in this order. Computer Configuration, Administrative Templates. System after that, scroll down and click the folder named Power Management. Then look for a setting called Power Throttling Settings and double-click it. A new window will pop up. Inside that, double-click Turn Off Power Throttling and another window will open. Choose the option enabled to turn off power throttling completely. This will make sure your CPU can always use its full power. This setting works on both Windows 10 and Windows 11. After selecting Enabled, click Apply, then OK and close the window. This change will help your computer work faster and better, especially when you play heavy games like Fortnite. Gear Up Booster is a best tool to reduce your ping while playing games. It works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it for free from my description and enjoy smoother gameplay with lower ping. Step 2. Boost Windows Performance with Chris Titus Tech. Utility. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Now we're going to make your PC even faster by using a tool called Chris Titus Tech Utility. This tool helps by removing useless background apps and services that slow down your system. First, open your FPS Boost Pack and look for a text file inside. Open the file and copy the code written in it. Next, go to the Windows search bar, type PowerShell, right-click on it, and select Run as Administrator. This gives PowerShell full permission to make changes to your computer. Now paste the code you copied earlier into PowerShell and press Enter. This will open the Chris Titus Tech Utility Tool. Once the tool opens, click the Tweaks tab. You will now see two preset options made to increase performance. The minimal preset is good for most users. It removes extra background features but keeps all the important ones working. The standard preset removes even more unnecessary things and boosts performance even more. Before making any changes, the tool will automatically create a system restore point, which means you can undo the changes later if needed. After you choose either minimal or standard, click the Run Tweaks button. When the process finishes, close the tool. This step will turn off services you don't need, fix FPS drops, lower lag, and boost your FPS overall. Step 3. Making your CPU work better by unparking CPU cores. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Your CPU has multiple cores, but sometimes Windows parks, turns off some of them to save power. This can cause slowdowns in games or when doing heavy tasks. To fix this, we're going to unpark all CPU cores using a tool called Unpark CPU. When CPU cores are unparked, your system can use all its power. This gives more speed and performance in games like Fortnite or CS2. When it opens, it will show which CPU cores are parked and which ones are active. To turn on all the cores, just click the Unpark button. This makes sure all your CPU cores are working and it helps your computer run faster and smoother. Step 4. Improve CPU performance using Throttle Stop to boost your CPU performance even more. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. We will use a tool called Throttle Stop. First, open the Tools folder on your computer and go into the Throttle Stop folder. Then open the Throttle Stop program by double-clicking it. Once it's open, you'll see several power modes. Performance, Game, Internet, and Battery mode. For the best gaming performance, choose the Game Power plan and then check the box for high performance. Out of all the available plans, high performance gives the best results. Next, look for options called Clock Mode, Set Multiplier, and Speed Shift settings. Do not change anything in those sections. Instead, simply click Disable Turbo so your CPU doesn't overheat unnecessarily. After that, click Turn On, and then click Save to keep the changes. Finally, keep Throttle Stop running in the background whenever your PC is on. This helps it keep your system fast and stable, giving you smooth gameplay all the time. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping while gaming. So first, download the Gear Up Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. 
On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Fortnite. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the End tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one or let GearUp automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to automatic for the best results. Finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster. This will help you optimize Fortnite or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 5. Maximize CPU performance by unlocking all processors. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Now I'll show you how to use a tool called MSI Utility to make your hardware components faster and more stable. After downloading the MSI Utility, open it to see the list of all your devices. Find your GPU model in the list. Since we're using the GPU to lower latency, check the box for MSI next to it and set the interrupt priority to high. Next, look for your integrated GPU, like Intel Graphics. Check the MSI box for that too and also set its priority to high. Once you've made these changes, click Apply to save the settings and then close the MSI Utility. This helps your GPU talk better with your system, which improves performance and reduces lag in games. Step 6. Improve your power plan for gaming performance. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. In this step, I'll show you how to change your power settings for better gaming performance. Go to the Windows search bar, type Power, and click Change Power Plan. If your plan is set to balanced, that means your CPU won't use full power, which is not good for gaming. Change it to High Performance or Ultimate Performance. If you don't see Ultimate Performance, follow these steps to enable it. Copy the special command from the video description. Open Command Prompt as Administrator. Paste the command into it and press Enter. After doing this, you'll get a message that says Ultimate Performance Mode is now available. Go back to your power plan settings and select Ultimate Performance. This setting allows your CPU to run at maximum speed, which helps stop FPS drops and makes games run smoother. Step 7. Optimizing Windows using the Storage Sense settings. Now open your system settings and search for Storage Sense. Open Storage Sense and turn it on. This feature will clean up junk files from your computer automatically, helping it stay fast. Under Configure Cleanup Schedules, set it to run every day. Also, set it to delete files in the recycle bin after 14 days. This keeps your PC clean and makes sure there's more space for games like Fortnite or Counter-Strike 2 to run better. After setting everything, click Run Storage Sense now and let it clean up your system. Doing this often will keep your PC faster, lighter, and cleaner without you needing to do it by hand. If this guide helped you, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos about Fortnite and Counter-Strike 2 and other PC optimization. I'll see you in the next one.